today, Doug and Gilma, and we're going to continue to see our temperatures warm up a little bit overnight. Let's take a look at what's happening right now on the satellite and radar combined. You can see some cloud cover in place, a couple of spotty showers still around. We're seeing some moderate rain in parts of the Metroplex. Our temperatures warmer by 17 degrees in McKinney than this time last night, 22 degrees warmer than this time last night in Paris, where it's now 65 degrees. But you see where the cool air is still holding on. Bridgeport 48, Gainesville 46. That all will change, though, over the next few hours as our temperatures continue to warm up with a warm front passing through. Talked about this a little bit earlier. We have a warm air mass that's in place. Cold front's going to meet that. And as those two air masses meet, the potential of storms developing. You see some isolated, strong to possibly severe storms in this lighter green color area, probably for tomorrow afternoon between noon to six. And then the yellow area, that slight risk of severe storms is also in the forecast. We could see some storms with golf ball size hail and 60 to 70 mile per hour wind gusts and frequent lightning as this cold front pushes through. So tomorrow morning, wake up to temperatures mid to the upper 60s. Here comes the frontal boundary working its way north to south. By the time we get closer towards noon to 1 o'clock, it's pushing its way closer towards the Metroplex and pushing its way through. We see those showers and storms developing along that by 4 to 5 o'clock, and they continue to make their way down towards the south and the east. So we'll keep our eyes on that. But the other thing you're noticing is the winds turn back to the north, and we have temperatures cooling down again before then warming our way back up on Wednesday. But tomorrow's forecast, much warmer than today. We start out in the mid-60s. We make it up to 85 for your high. Rain and storm chances 40%, and then those temperatures dropping by 16, 67 degrees. Here's the breakdown of the rain percentage coverage. We'll see about a 30 to 40% chance through parts of the Metroplex. Higher chances in the southeast, where the frontal boundary takes its time pushing its way through. How much rain are we talking about? Well, you can see in some localized spots, maybe a tenth of an inch. Other areas, maybe near an inch as those storms will be developing for us. The seven day forecast shows quite the roller coaster ride. We start out at 44 Wednesday morning, 64 Wednesday afternoon, Thursday seeing 76. Another front approaches. Friday we have some rain in the forecast. Front passes through, cools us back down. We're 58 Saturday, then by Sunday back into the mid 70s. You're watching CBS 11 News, the ones for